today I'm going to review for you the new Makeup Geek blushes. I'm really excited for them. They are beautiful and gorgeous. I have five to review for you. That's all I got this time, but I'm definitely going to get more. So I want to start with the most beautiful one to me first. This one is Hanky Pinky. Funny name for it, but appropriate. So I'm going to swatch them on my hand for you and then also use a brush so you can kind of see what it looks like um, when it's brushed out. So this one is Hanky Pinky and um, Makeup Geek is known for their eyeshadows but she just released last week her blushes. I think they're gorgeous. They're beautiful. So this is Hanky Pinky and it's just kind of like a nice pinky color not too bright, not too boring, just perfect, perfect pink color. And then if I were to blush it, let's see if I can show you guys. Can you see that? It's kind of not fully blushed out, but you get the point. <laughs> so it's just a beautiful color on the cheek. It's beautiful. So I'm really excited about this one. This one is Hinky Pinky. And then the next one that I have is the one that I am really, really excited about because I don't have any colors like this. It's kind of a mauve color, but it does have like just a hint of a sheen to it. But it's just a beautiful pinky mauve color. So let me just swatch it here for you. And then I think maybe the best thing to do would be like to put some here and then blend it out maybe can you guys see that okay maybe you can see that okay so there's that there's a swatch and here's it blended out hopefully you can see the blended out part so it would look just like that it's a little bit more blended so that one is very very pretty as well so all of these blushes are just super pigmented, just like her um, eyeshadows are. They're just very, very pigmented. The next is a very light pink, but it's kind of like a cool tone, cool undertone of purple in it. Just kind of like a beautiful lilac, but just a little bit more pink. So I'll give you a swatch of it here. Oop, my hand's still wet. So here's the swatch, there's the swatch, and then if I swatch them here and blend it out, and I am cleaning the brush in between just so you know. So there's it kind of blended out a little bit so you can see. So that one's beautiful, and some of these have a nice sheen to them, like this one has just a nice sheen. Um, there's a few pieces of glitter but nothing that you can even see like I'm talking like three or four in the whole thing so just a nice sheen to it and the next one is called Spellbound I think a lot of people got this one because it's the most um, neutral so I did hear of a lot of people getting this color so it's just kind of like a pink tan kind of like just a peachy pink it's just beautiful like I'm not very good at describing colors I'm sorry I know what they are but I'm just not very good at it so like a yeah like a pinky mauve or peachy mauve excuse me and then I'll put some more over here and blend it out can you see that let's try to blend them both <laughs> so there you go there's a little bit of this swatch here and then blend it out just what it would look like. So this is just like an everyday kind of natural, but just like a little something on your cheeks. I like this one. And then the one I'm wearing today, because I wanted to kind of go lighter face, but then I decided to do a smoky eye, and you can't really do a smoky eye and go too light of a face. So I did this one, and this one is a same thing. It has a nice sheen to it, and this is Head Over Heels. And it's just beautiful has kind of like a shimmer to it so you get kind of like that highlight on your cheeks so I wouldn't use a highlighter with the blush but this one is just a nice pretty everyday kind of pink like 
just your light pink just kind of you know gives something to the face nothing too sparkly but just a nice sheen to it it just blends out beautifully and it just has that sheen that leaves on your skin so you don't need a highlighter with this one at all unless you really like to be shiny <laughs> but I really like these I mean her blushes are just like her eyeshadows and if you don't have her eyeshadows I'll leave the, t um, the review that I just did on some of the eyeshadows that I bought down below so you can see but her shadows are amazing her blushes are amazing they're just so pigmented they're creamy and soft and I think this would definitely last you a while because the more pigment you have the less that you have to use of it so I really think that she did a great job and I will take a picture of all of them with swatches at the end for you and thank you so much for watching you guys I really appreciate it I appreciate your sweet comments and I hope that more of you will subscribe so you don't miss any of my new videos and if you like this review of the Makeup Geek blushes the five that I have then go ahead and like this down below and thank you for watching and have a great day bye guys